Hello my brother The money don't enter Call Isabella Or Maratuna Walla wa feno Peppa o peppa o Currency o currency o Peppa o peppa o Currency o currency o Mano Hi guys, how y'all doing? It's your girl Cover Royalty and we're back again. If this is your first time on my channel, please do hit the subscribe button. And if this is not your first time, welcome back for another amazing and exciting content. So today we're going to be doing a versus social life in Nigeria versus social life in Ireland. Um, basically, so like these are like the two places I've stayed. So yeah, I'm going to be doing a social life between Nigeria and social life in Ireland. But yeah, I'm not alone today. Today, I have my friend with me and you know in a minute you're gonna be seeing her and she's gonna introduce herself to you so stay right into the video and I will be back <laughs> hi guys so I'm back again and I'm here with my friend hi yeah our name is blessing so um we're gonna be um saying um you know a few things about our social life in nigeria because obviously she stayed in nigeria and she has stayed in ireland too so obviously i'm gonna be asking her the same question but before we go i'm gonna start with myself i'm gonna be saying a few things about um, my social life in nigeria and my social life in ireland so um <clears throat> basically <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <that's serious. laughs> yeah so first off i would say like um our social life in um nigeria is way cool and better than my social life in ireland you know even without the lockdown or whatever it is you can, i would say my social life in nigeria is way better because like in nigeria there are like so so many places to go and so many things to do you necessarily don't have to go to the club to actually have a social life you get you can just say okay yes you and your friends are just going to chill out and all of that but here the only places you get to chill out in ireland is probably you're going to the restaurant maybe it's just for me or maybe i don't really go out i don't know but maybe you just say oh you're going to chill out in a restaurant or you're going to the pub or maybe your friends are just having like a house party basically that's it but in nigeria you have a lounge to go to you have the swimming pool to go to you have the beach to go to yeah <laughs> you have you have like absolutely so many even house party stuff is outrated in nigeria like who wants to go for a house party in nigeria nobody but you can only do that here so i would say like my social life in nigeria was like 100 but coming down here <laughs> it was like i became it was, it was even like i do not even have a social life basically <laughs> i feel like i do not have a social life like coming to see ireland and all of that but yeah what are your thoughts what do you think like how's your social life in nigeria compared to you know ireland, ireland. now yeah well um there's a huge difference between um africa yeah and the european country okay the way the lifestyle the culture the mentality the environment and all that stuff yeah true so i would say my lifestyle or my social life in nigeria was Okay, from my upbringing, I was a very quiet and not outdoor person. I was always an indoor person, to be honest. Yeah. For real? I know I don't look it here, but that's the truth. <laughs> you got me shocked. <laughs> yeah, that, that's, but that's the truth, yeah. I'm always the indoor person because my friends were really very strict with me. Um, and I hardly had friends. My, I could count the friends I had, and that was from school. So it's always like from school, back home, or from home. You go to my dad's office and that's it, you know. So my social life in Nigeria was really, really quiet. Huh. Yeah, really, really quiet. I wasn't really the outdoor person, but trust me, I've always been friendly. I'm a very friendly and nice person to be with, you know. And compared to here, I think I'm more like, more exposed here because probably I'm independent. In Nigeria, I wasn't living with my parents, so I don't have that. Oh, where are you going to? Oh, you must be back around 7 o'clock. I don't <laughs> want to see you outside. Who are you with? You know, really? this kind of monitoring or us calling you. Oh, why are you not back by this time? No. Here, like, I'm independent and I can make my decisions. I can be with the people I want to be with. I can hang out wherever I want to go to. Regardless of the lockdown. Before the lockdown, yeah, we had a free life, you know. 
you could go out to the pub, go to the club, um, go to have your girls out uh, night out with your friends, go to the movies, you know, just chill out and have fun. But the lockdown this time around just made everything really, really quiet and depressing. I am so tired of this lockdown. Yeah, it really made everything depressing, yeah. And even with the lockdown, trust me, I'm still having my phone. She so, is actually. <laughs> <laughs> if I want to have my phone, I go, like, I do my thing and then hang out, you know. Sometimes I'll be like, this auntie, <laughs> are you not tired? Like, <laughs> yeah, so that's it. I think I prefer my lifestyle here because I'm independent. That's what I'll say. Yeah. I don't. <laughs> I literally don't. You know, back at home, yeah, obviously, my mom is there, she get my dad is there, but the thing is that I do get to go out and, you know, if I tell my mom, oh, I'm not coming back today, or I'm not coming back by this time, she's like, cool with it, she get, and obviously, I had an auntie that, you know, we always go out together and all of that, so, I would say, like, my life in Nigeria was, like, my social life in Nigeria was oh, way better. And coming down here, I find myself very lazy to actually go out. I don't know. I feel like maybe it's because of the weather. But I'm supposed to get I'm supposed to be used to it by now. But I don't think so I can actually get used to this kind of weather. Well you have to. We have to. <laughs> no, I don't think so I can actually get used to this kind of weather. But like, yeah, I would say like here in Ireland, like going out for me is is like you're telling me to do this hard job. Or you're telling me to do this work <laughs> that I kind of seem to find myself doing. Do you understand? And obviously, going to the restaurant, can eat, or maybe say you're going to your friend's house party. And in as much as I am not a club person, like I hardly go to clubs. I I don't I don't even see myself in clubs. I love like. to go to club, man, to socialize with my friends. You know, we just go to the club and ask me, oh yeah yeah, go. Okay. <laughs> I am not that kind of person. I prefer I just go to like a lounge. I see I love being free. I could literally just wear a shirt and a short with sleepers. I probably just go to a lounge. I just go and eat, drink and come back home. And like, you know, feel so good with ourselves and all of that. That's kind of like, you know, social life I do have. But here, you know, everything is just somehow coupled with the lockdown again. If someone is not careful, you could actually go into depression, like seriously. It does not to that level, to be honest. I heard of <sighs> someone that committed suicide last week. Imagine. Due to depression, you know, it's really, really getting so sad. And <gasps> we need our social so life on. back. We need it, man. We need to go back to the, our life we're living previously. It's not this life now. Trust me. It's, it's not good. It's not going anywhere. Yeah, so just, I know. would say like for me, yeah, you know, even you know, I would even say that like you know, people even find Nigeria social life even more interesting because yeah, like definitely. most of the time you see everybody wanting to like okay, fine. If you say that yes, other countries are like so exciting. Yeah. Why is it that when it comes to Christmas, everybody's running back to Nigeria? Because you have occasions, you have weddings, see, Nigeria you have is uh, you fun. have events to attend, you have house opening, you have um naming ceremony. They love, they love. Um, there are a lot of things to, to, to do to go in, for in, in Africa. Yeah, Nigeria, you know. So you can't even compare, you know. Here, That's everybody the minds their saying. business here, and everybody likes sim simplicity here. No complicated. We don't like no, they don't, the lifestyle here. They don't like the the lousy lifestyle, or, or we have to invite the old crowd. We have to invite everyone that you know. They just like it, be simple and quiet, you know. But Nigeria, trust us. Like, if you don't make loud, if you don't make loud noise, you never stop at you. As in, like no car. You never like, stop at you. As in, and that's that's the fun thing about it. That's why you know. Christmas in Nigeria is always amazing. I spent yeah. one Christmas in Ireland, yeah, and I'm like, it was still amazing, no, trust me. Mm -hmm. uh -uh. My auntie, you know, you know, it is still really amazing. Do you understand? But I know what it will be like, you know, if I was in Nigeria, but I still had my fun, no doubt, because I was with family and I was with my cousins. I'm sure you guys like saw my, um, last video, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, obviously, that was like a Christmas shenanigans with my family and all of that. Just a little bit of snippet of what we you know did for Christmas. <laughs> The sad thing is that I haven't been to Nigeria since I got here and it's really, really sad. I want like, to go to Nigeria. I really want to go to Nigeria. I really want to go to Nigeria. Point, it's just I want to explore myself. Because <laughs> <laughs> trust me, everybody just wants to run down to Nigeria. Because yeah. that is where it's happening. Yeah. You cannot tell me your social life in Nigeria is boring, except you have strict parents, just like this auntie. No, that was there you know, when I was much younger. Not when, not when adults, please. You know, <laughs> yeah. But I would say like... 
back in Nigeria, I had so much fun than here, Chica. Except mm. you were like, you know, people you know and all of that. So I don't know what you guys think. What are your thoughts? Comment below what you think. Um, social life in Nigeria versus social life in Ireland. That's for people that stay in Ireland. But for those that don't stay in Ireland, you know, that stay in Canada, other countries. Tell me what you think about your social life back there in Nigeria. That is if you're in Nigeria or if you're in Africa, wherever it is you are. Tell me your social life back there and your social life in another country. What you guys think, you know. But I would say I would still choose Nigeria anytime <laughs> any day like my job for life like <laughs> on, on, no cap about that i would yeah. say yeah you have so much fun in nigeria than in any other place even people born outside the country once they get to nigeria and they see the fun it's, it's like they, vibe. yeah it's a different vibe it's like yeah, they don't want to come back at mm -hmm. all chica yeah. so yeah i would say like for me nigeria is top notch social life there is amazing I'm not so much of oh I want to go to pubs and be drinking. Hell no, 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 no. no, no if you're not no. going out with your friends. What are you going to the pub to do? What I do. I, I'm not even a fan of that. So, so that's another thing. You know, I'm not a fan of them pubs. Your friends. There are so, other places you can hang out. You know, I feel like have a good time. If I want to have fun in Ireland, yeah, basically I probably just want to have like the girls thingy, and we would just probably go to another county and just yeah. have like you know so much fun it's there. Fun now, yeah. Do you understand? Yeah. Like mm -hmm. I feel like that's like so much fun for me, or the house, the little little house parties, or just to get together, you know, yeah. like with people you like, you know, you vibe with and all of that. I feel like that's like somewhat fun for me in Ireland <laughs> here. Yes, yeah, so, and like I said do comment your um you know what you think about your social life in your hometown or wherever it is and in another country and also do like comment share and subscribe to my channel guys yeah, do yeah. subscribe subscribe <laughs> <laughs> all right guys i love you all and um see you guys some other time bye bye yeah <laughs>